Habakkuk chapter 1, Habakkuk is is really struggling. It's a conversation between the prophet and the Lord. And so the first couple of verses, Habakkuk speaking. The next few verses, the Lord is speaking. And then um, in verse 12 here, it's starting again with Habakkuk. And he, Habakkuk is struggling with the idea of God using wicked people to to punish the children of Israel. So for example in verse 13 he says thou art of pure eyes than to behold evil and canst not look on iniquity wherefore lookest thou upon them that deal treacherously and holdest thy tongue when the wicked devoureth the man that is more righteous than he. And I think that this is a common thing God often will use the wicked people to punish wicked people even the righteous and the whole book of mormon is essentially um a narrative of the nephites well and not always the nephites but the people of god whether it's the nephites or the lamanites or the jaredites being um being corrected by the people who weren't of god and i think this is a common method that habakkuk is struggling with and there's lots of examples in the scriptures not just in Habakkuk's time but I but yeah so I think that that's hard um it, but it's interesting to see that these prophets wrestle with doubts and wrestle with these things oftentimes we sometimes think of prophets as these perfect people um who never had doubts never had problems but they often did and they often struggled and there's there's Habakkuk here, but there's countless other examples of Joseph Smith struggling, of um, of Peter struggling, of Paul struggling, of um, of lots of prophets struggling, Moses struggling. It's a very common thing. Um, these are definitely human people who struggle with similar things that we struggled with, and that we struggle with.